Hello, Wayne Barron here from Dark Effects TV here to bring you the second in our After Effects beginning tutorials. Our first one was uh, how to use the text tool and this one right here is how to use the 3D tool to uh, turn your uh, objects into a 3D object. And uh, 3D objects is uh, basically the, a very good way to really make your projects stand out from others. And so let's go ahead and uh, let's get started with this quick tutorial on how to use the 3D uh, solid, uh, which is what we're going to be doing here. So with uh, our new project, let's go ahead and uh, create a new composition. And we're going to use this as comp1. We've got it set at 5 seconds. Uh, any setting that you want here, uh, depending on your project that you want to create. And so let's click on Light New Solid. And then here, let's just name this 3D and click OK. And now with our 3D layer selected, let's click on right here. You'll see the 3D layer. Click there and it put a little box inside of this area here. And this will give you your Y, your X, and your Z arrows, or what's called as the axis. And so what we want to do here is that we want to, uh, well, let's just run through some things. We can uh, use the green arrow and we can move our object down or up. That's our Y axis. On our X axis, which is our red arrow, we can move side to side. And then our blue arrow, which is our Z axis, we can move it back or forwards. Ah, there you go. Alright, back or forward. And so, what we want to do here is that we are going to make it lay flat on its, on the bottom, sort of like a floor. So if you wanted to create a project that's got floors and walls and a ceiling, then you would use this method. So what we're going to do is either click on the W on your keyboard or the rotation tool up here. And then whenever you get over here, you need to make sure that it's showing the arrow like this. Not the arrow with the letter in it, but just the circle or arrow. And then once you get the circle or arrow, if you want to create a floor or a ceiling, you pull up. And then you hit the shift key to make it flat and then choosing the select tool or the V on your keyboard you drag it down this will give you your floor or you can drag it up to give it your ceiling and so that's basically all there is to it in uh, creating a layer uh, into 3D space so let's uh, do that one more quick time we go to layer new solid and then click OK. We make sure that we set it as a 3D layer and then we choose the rotation tool or W on your keyboard. Make sure that it's a circular arrow without a letter in it and then you pull up and you hit the tab key to make it flat. Your V or the arrow tool and then you pull it down and that is how you do a 3d layer for a solid thank you very much for watching i hope that you enjoyed this quick lesson and uh, once again subscribe and keep in touch wayne barron dark effects tv